Doppler. We put up with clouds for much of today, but now with the day coming to an end, we're seeing a lot more sunshine out there. The afternoon hours brought some nice clearing and pretty nice conditions on the WVTM 13 live Doppler. We're not showing any rain. There is a front coming through and I can't rule out a couple sprinkles or a light shower tonight, but most areas will stay rain free. You can see how it gets cooler across the north. 75 in Coleman, 77 Haleyville, 80 in Fort Payne, 82 Birmingham and Alabaster, 86 degrees in Tuscaloosa for this evening. Skies overhead partly cloudy, cooling down to about 71 by 11. Then the cooler air mass does kick in mid 60s by 1 a.m. down to the 50s beyond that point. When you first get up tomorrow morning and step outside, it's going to feel different. It's going to feel cooler. It's going to feel less humid. You will tell the change and then a new air mass is in place. Lots of cool air across the north. 50s widespread Wisconsin, northern Illinois, also in Montana. Several waves of cooler air for us this week. The first one comes in late tonight and tomorrow. The next one comes in Friday and Saturday and the weekend's going to be a whole lot cooler than it's been. Here's our short term model forecast and it shows a few of those light showers or sprinkles coming into northwest Alabama at seven o'clock. They certainly fall apart very quickly and that's why I think most of us will still be rain free and where it does rain. We're talking 20 minutes, maybe 15 minutes and very small amounts and that'll be gone by morning. We'll just have clear skies, sunshine all day tomorrow. Should be a very nice day, a little bit cooler than today, but a lot less humid. You will feel the change tomorrow. It's going to feel a lot different outside for sure. OK, in terms of rain chances this week, not zero, but close to it. We'll call it about 10% this evening. No chance Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday, then about 10% on Friday. That's the next front coming in. None on Saturday, probably the driest week we've seen in quite some time. Here's our long term model forecast. Start off Wednesday morning with clear skies in place. That doesn't change much at all during the day. Thursday starts off mostly clear. Then this next front comes. Looks pretty impressive on its approach, but by the time it gets to us, most of that rain falls apart, and that's why our rain chance only 10%. Once it's through, though, much cooler, much less humid. It'll feel truly like November by the time we get to this weekend. Seven day forecast tomorrow. Then beautiful sunshine all day, a little bit cooler, much less humid than today. 77 year high down to 52 tomorrow night. 81 beautiful day on Wednesday. A few more clouds Thursday Then much cooler air on Friday. Mid 60s for highs. Look at the lows. 43 come Friday night, Saturday morning. 68 the high Saturday getting back up to 70 on Sunday. That looks like a good weekend if you don't mind it being a whole lot cooler. Guy and Sherry.